He's Jeff Worthington. Hey. Traveling around the country doing different jobs because he's got nothing better to do. Oh, yeah, I'm back. He's Jeff Worthington. In business. Jack of all trades, different job every day. Every day. He's bringing his stories to you. That's me. Wednesday, March 12th. The law offices of Worthington, Worthington, and Smith. Uh, uh, another another day, another dollar. Uh, here at the law offices of Worthington, Worthington, and Smith. Hey, Horace, good morning. Um... Good morning. Morning. Good Jeff. morning. Morning. I'm gonna need a black coffee from Jeff, Dunkin' it's Donuts. 1 p.m. Uh, my crocodile skin briefcase and a pencil sharpener. I need to get to work. When did you get a crocodile skin brief? Anyway, Jeff, it's 1 p.m. You're supposed to be here at 9:30 this morning. What? We've got clients to work with. No, 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 horse, horse. When I'm the lawyer, I get to come in whenever I want. You get to handle things until I get here. No, I. That's have, why my I've, name's twice. No, but I. Yeah, that I would need to talk to you about that. Why is your name up there twice? You don't have a brother. You don't have any other re- you know what? relatives. Who I get my name here. twice because I went to four years of law school. No, you did not. That was no. two hundred grand no. out of pocket. No, you didn't pay a thing. The network has just decided to push us off into this law office because we've been causing too much trouble on those boats and all that other crap that we've been doing oh, recently. Oh, well, la de freaking da. I know, that's what I Finally said. Finally get I to help out the people and you're still naysaying. No, I just thought it was kind of an insult that the network decided to put, push all this crap off on us. And we haven't had a customer or a client, if you will, in like three months. And finally, somebody shows up. What? You're supposed to be here at 9.30. What? In the, yeah, somebody's here. We have here. a client? We got somebody here. Oh, wow. He showed up half an hour ago. Okay. He wants to... Uh, Who is to, it? I don't know. I don't know. Jeff, well, I guess I'm if he showed sure. up a half hour ago, it doesn't really if matter were, if I showed up a half hour late. If you were here late. at 9.30, you know exactly who oh, yeah, he was. Oh, yeah, you know. Anyway, uh, who is it? His name's Boomer Merrill, and uh, apparently had some sort of traffic Boomer? infraction. Yeah. His name's yeah, Boomer? Yeah, pretty sweet name, I think. Was he from, like, Stark? I have no... Well, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Waldo. Uh, but, yeah, he's got... <laughs> That's um, a speed trap. What do you get? Speeding ticket? He ran a stop sign, I guess, uh, rolled through it at like two miles an hour. Which what? Is, I know. I That's mean, completely legal. It, I mean, it should it's be. It's a stop sign. Honestly. I mean, two miles an hour is basically a stop. Honestly, it should be. But apparently he ran into some sort of, uh, you know, crooked cop or some guy. That oh, was my gosh. Waldo was extent. known for its crooked cops. Right. And um, Well, let's talk to the man. Yeah, yeah. Let's young man. Young man, man come into the office. Hey, guys. Nice to meet you. Dr. Worthington. Oh, nice to meet you. Wait, doctor? What? He's n- no, don't encourage him. He's not a real doctor. Oh, I am. Anyways, my name's Boomer Merrill. And, nice uh, to meet you, Chief. <laughs> I just wanted to uh, talk to you and have you represent me when I take this uh, traffic violation to the head county sheriff. So are you, uh, what, what exactly are you planning on doing? I mean, do you really think this is going to be like that big of a case? Oh, no. You know, thanks I for think remembering I was a doctor, by the way. No Sorry. problem. That's what it says, it says on that plaque on the wall there. Where did you get? Uh, there's a plaque. Jeff, when did you have that plaque made? Well, when I graduated from Stark School of Law, I I, I made a plaque, you know, just to indicate right, Jeff, my level of education. Know that that's a complete and utter falsity, and there's no way. What? The, the plaque is real. All right, Boomer, uh, go ahead and continue there. Yeah, well, uh, I got a traffic violation, uh, rolling a stop sign, right, which right, is completely that's, legal. That's awful. And, uh, um, I think we can. Yeah, I think the cop was a little misunderstood. Oh, so you you really don't think we need to take this to court then? You oh no, it's it's not a big deal. We can we can settle just this. Kind of whoa, 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 court. whoa, 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 Nancy's. Uh, we're at a law office here, and what we do is we go to court. But and, I, I don't really. Think and we fight the system until we, we win. To, I don't know about that, Doctor Worthington. He says we don't uh, need yeah, to see, go. It's no, not but, not but that big a deal. I, Doctor Worthington, the lawyer. My name's twice. Believe we can Pretty fight this. And win money. But he says we don't need to go to... I don't think... I don't really don't think it's necessary. Well, no, if, he, this, if this he's a doctor... Has, this man has suffered mental, physical abuse and needs to be reimbursed by the state. And if he's a doctor, he knows court. what he's doing. 